Okay, so here's our one inch piece. It's five inches long. I'm going to heat this up, then I'm going to heat the glue I have sitting on here, and then I'm going to press it onto one side, press it onto the one side, open up the other side, and bring them together. And that will fuse both sides of the stirrup together. So here we go. All right, so now that it's hot enough, I'm just gonna heat up the glue. I'm gonna take this, spread it apart, and then I'm just going to put the one inch pipe over the one side. And then I take the other side. Okay. So once you've got it, this is what it looks like. So I'm just applying a little bit of pressure so that it really comes together nicely. But there it is. Here's the finished stirrup. But once this cools, I can go ahead and start putting everything together. So let's do that. Alright, so now it's time to start putting everything together. So here's the crossbow stock or tiller. And what we're going to start is we're going to be gluing the arrow rest on. So we're actually going to put it about an inch away from the end of the stock here. That way there's plenty of room for wrapping and it doesn't interfere with anything. So this is what it's going to look like. So once you figure it out where it's going to go, you're going to want to apply glue to this part of the stock. So I'm going to be doing that. Okay, so the glue is applied. So I'm just going to heat it up. And then I take my power rest and place it on. I want to make sure that the bristles just touch the bottom, as you can see right there. So just hold that in place until it sets. Alright. Once it's set, do the same thing to the other side. Okay, using the other side as a guide. You want to just go ahead and line both sides up. You can see here they are. So here's this section all put together so that when you have your bolt, you can drop it down here onto the string and then drop it down into the front and the bristles will hold it in. And then when you fire, it'll be able to come through and come out. So there it is. So now that we've got that, we're going to work on attaching the prod to the tiller. Now that we have the hour rest on here, we're going to be attaching the prod onto the stock. So the first thing that you want to do is just figure out where is it going to go. Find out where does it go where it looks balanced, where it fits with everything. You want to put it right directly on the middle. So to get it to stay here while we're wrapping, 
I'm going to be using hot melt glue, and it's not for structural reasons, it's just to hold it in for right now. So I'm going to apply some glue and then stick this on. I'll show you what that looks like. 